Yo, what's up? Lotus Wolf Pod here. I used to do this all the time. I used to make things look really cool and stuff like four or five years ago or whatever. But you know what? I just don't care about that anymore. I'm just trying to get this started again and see what happens. So I'll call this the Lotus Wolf Podcast, like part one. <laughs> because if anybody knows anything about any of my past or whatever, I've done hours and hours and years and years of this shit and to have to start all over again is just whatever you're either watching or you aren't if you are good if not maybe i'll get some new people uh maybe i'll try to make things look all right you know there's if you know anything about my old podcasts uh the glare really bugs me like you see i just got this yesterday which is uh basically the chain smoker 2 by monoxide right the deluxe edition right you don't just get all of the regular uh songs but you also get a bunch of bonus shit as well so i tried to put that right there it looks really cool but of course you know there's always a glare and shit and that's the actual cd there you got the yeah, I'll just bring it and show you just so you know what I'm talking about. You know, you got the CD and you got the actual uh, signature from Monoxide from Twisted, right? So that's what's in the background there. Either you know or you don't know. And then you got Mr. Violent J up there. You got Billy Eilish there. Eilish, sorry. Uh, representing for Shady, Dark Lotus. Uh, just to get all that out of the way. And, you know, like, maybe this will end up turning out good. Maybe it won't. Maybe I'll get some things off my chest, which I need to. But there are some things that I really want to talk about and I really want to say. But I got to I gotta watch what I say because uh, of some things you may or may not find out in the future. Uh, maybe even coming on here is a bad idea. <laughs> but I felt like it was it was the right time to do this shit right now and you know uh, I'm gonna try not to you know incriminate myself in any way or you know talk about certain people or certain aspects and things in my life uh, just try and keep it on the real on the trail for y'all and try to you know I keep saying number one the Lotus Wolf podcast one well we'll we'll consider this like the test and then we'll see where it goes from there if it gets a good response good if it doesn't i don't really give a fuck so <laughs> we'll just see what happens and uh you know maybe i'll work on the, the lighting there's always going to be a stupid ass glare there and you know like you know get monoxide in there more but now i'm not as comfortable so i'm going to move my chair back and now you see the fucking glare there that's always bothered me in the past and you know like whatever i explained it so basically the last year has been a very very tough time for me not saying it's always been good uh my old lotus wolf pod channel got uh <laughs> got shut down and now i finally got this other one up and i've been posting audio i've been posting songs you know that i've done uh a lot about uh you know this actress isabel Furman and stuff but uh i'm i'm very disappointed with her right now and not very happy with that and the girl i was with before who i'm not with anymore i guess i don't know i'm not i don't even know what's going on with that but we can't get really get into that so uh it's, it's basically, you know, Allegra Geller from Existence, you know, the David Cronenberg film with Jude Law and Jennifer Jason Lee. That's, uh, we'll just, we'll say that's, that's what I was with. Maybe I've said too much. Maybe not. Maybe the cops will end up at my door. Who fucking knows? But either way, I'm not going to talk about that anymore. Uh, basically shit has been rough man i haven't been on doing podcasts for a long time 
Uh, the first time four years ago when isolation started and Mr. Tom Green from California started doing his podcasts, inspired me and my girlfriend at the time uh, to get on there and to do some podcasts. And then, you know, three years later or whatever, shit happened. And in, in my life, Plus, YouTube didn't like, you know, I started speaking my mind a little bit too much or whatever. So I'm going to try to, you know, censor myself a little bit more than than usual. You know, like, don't want to get in trouble. You got to keep things on the on the DL or whatever, things that are going on. Uh, I'm on here to talk about, you know, basically, you know, like things like entertainment. And that includes movies and music and current events. And maybe in the future, girls and relationships and stuff. But I got to kind of keep that on the low. As I said, I've loved Isabel Furman for a long time. A girl from the orphan and stuff. And I'm not very happy with her right now either. So <coughs> some some things are going down. And, you know, uh, I just I haven't had really good good luck with girls ever and it's just it it it's just all come full circle now and uh, and then i discovered you know like tom green started doing his van podcast and now he's doing it from his farm with his his mule fanny and and his donkey kia and his dog charlie and now he lives in canada again and on his farm and i'm like you know what life is too short you can't you can't let a girl dictate what you can and cannot do although she can dictate certain things like that you can or can't say and that's all i'm going to say about that uh if that if that ends up being an issue then at least hopefully this will be on youtube and you can watch it and maybe come to my aid or come to my rescue you know you never know but, uh, you know, I've always been a nice person, you know, like I'm a nice person and everything and, you know, and you have someone screaming at you and stuff and it's just a little bit too much sometimes and you gotta, sometimes you gotta end things and relationships and shit like that and sometimes you just can't get over that shit and I can't and I whatever i'm spending way too much time talking about that uh i talk about juggalo stuff i talk about tom green i talk about movie ideas that i've got you know in the in the works right now and that i have had in the works things that i've already talked about hours and hours before before they cut my youtube channel off this time i'm not going to be you know saying too much that you know, as I said, it's going to be incriminating or anything. Not going to get into specific details or some names have to be changed. You know, like some people maybe never even existed, you know. And, you know, like I'm not, I'm going to try to, you know, like even just being, you know, I'm nice, but I'm just going to try to get these things, things that, I need to get off my mind, my chest or whatever, uh, in a way that, you know, if it seems like I'm maybe unenthusiastic, it's because, you know, I've, I've already done this so many times before and to have to come on here and be like, oh, well, this is my number one podcast. This is really like number 400 or something. So, I mean... I've been alone for a long time and that's, 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 I don't like it. You know, I like living with someone and being with someone and being with someone I really cared about who basically ruined my life. And, and then YouTube, you know, cut off all my other thousands of videos. So I'm starting a new here. Hopefully we'll get to number two or three, as opposed to me just saying, oh, well, this is number one. Because on this channel, uh, if you go back, like, I think uh, 100 videos now, uh, I did try to start the podcast with uh, a Lana Del Rey retrospective 
I don't know if you know about that. If not, you can check it out. And then uh, discovering, you know, I have a lot of time on my hands, so I just look on YouTube, I guess, and do what I have to do and don't really have a lot of friends coming around or anything, you know, trying to stay positive during all the bullshit of life and, you know, the whatever's going on, which you don't need to know about that right now. I, I hinted at things, but, you know, like, if this is going to be online or whatever, then basically you can't know about a lot of things. So let's just keep it nice and keep it simple and say this is like my first podcast and hopefully we'll get to a second podcast if, you know, I'm not killed or <laughs> some shit because of the things that I say. And, you know, I'm, I'm through with like trying to be nice because I am nice and being told that I'm not nice all the time. Uh, I'm just going to try to get things out, you know, like out on the, on the, on the table and just, you know, try to be as pleasant as possible, as entertaining as possible. But if I'm not, then that's okay too, because I'm just trying to say some things and trying to get this started again uh trying to say things i said a hundred times before and trying to you know move on and step up my game again <laughs> i already did it like i made it so good before or it was starting to really get up and now i have to basically start at square one again and i don't have the one i love anymore all the girls that I'm interested in or whatever, they don't like me, whatever. Uh, now, you know, there's the Caitlin Marie. She's uh, she's scared on YouTube. She's very entertaining. The book Leo, that's Leonie Crystal. She talks about books a lot. And there's Tom Green who is on his farm and they go out in the wilderness and he's doing things without, like, battery power and stuff like going off the grid and stuff and has a van and he has his cute dog charlie and stuff that's the kind of stuff that really inspires me and you know it, it's and, and shaggy too dope he's making his own podcast and i think that's freaking hilarious you know like and manny he's funny they're coming to town again who knows maybe shaggy <laughs> You and me maybe can have a chat. You know, there's some bullshit going on. And uh, Dark Lotus and Twisted and ICP going boop. <laughs> Magic Ninja and Psychopathic Records. Some bullshit, man. So, getting past that. Uh, basically, you know, I'll, I'll try this and we'll try to get to something that's slightly entertaining. If not, whatever. I'm getting my ideas out. So I uh, I basically wrote this kind of declaration for like what's going on right now. And we all know I don't remember my fucking li words or lyrics worth shit. So I'm going to read it straight from the page. And that's the way it's got to be. You know, if that's the way it's got to be, that's the way it's got to be. And... Uh, Thank goodness for entertainment and all that. And just a couple days ago, my good luck charm, which was Isabel, is just, she's now not my good luck charm anymore. And I'm pretty upset about that. And some shit's going down. And it's just like, so I'm not trying to waste your time. This is just, consider this like podcast number one. <laughs> And hopefully we get to podcast number two, the Lotus Wolf podcast number two. So we'll just start with this. Maybe I'll change the decorations up a little bit here so it makes more sense. But if it doesn't make sense, whatever, you're probably not even watching right now and, you know, whatever. Uh, you really do matter to me. I love the people that care. There's a lot of people out there right now that don't care or that don't give a shit or don't understand. 
Like you could be watching me right now and be like, what's this guy talking about? If you're still watching here, if you've watched 15 minutes thus far, then thank you. And I promise I'm going to try to make this get better and everything. This is just like the, the test to see if this even works, you know. So I'm not going to spend too much time. I Basically, that's the explanation up to thus far. And I'm just going to, I'm going to read like basically the, my declaration for 2024 and where I want this to go. And I'm also going to thank some people as well. And as I said, if your name's not on there, it's not because I don't love you or like you or care about you. It's just, I'm trying to make it, you know, simple, you know, like in school. You have a lot of friends and stuff, like lots and lots of friends when you're 17 years old and stuff. And, uh, and then when you grow up, uh, you have a lot, a lot less, you know, a lot of less of those people. And you know what? That's okay. That's okay that you're not in touch with all of them anymore. And uh, if you stay in touch with them, that's cool too. But uh, at the expense of, you know, someone for the people who actually care and love you, and you're just, you know, in the past and, you know, you're giving the, all the attention to the, the wrong people and everything. Uh, what can I say about that? If you're watching this right now, then you are the person that is important right now. Not someone who was back in sixth grade who doesn't give a shit, you know, or friends that screwed you in the past. Uh, girls that have manipulated and dominated your world who you thought you loved and you loved them. They maybe loved you and you found out, you know, maybe they never really loved you and stuff like that. That's, that's some, that's some bullshit. But, uh, you know, I, you know, like just, just blame it all on Isabel. Just blame it all on Isabel because, you know, like, I liked her and everything, and she, she's been doing some things lately that's really, that, like, I've seen some things, and I've basically been traumatized and scarred for life, and uh, I'm not very happy with her right now, but <laughs> that's not saying I, I never, like, I still don't care about her and everything. It's one of the best actresses, if not the best actresses in Hollywood. And if you don't agree with that, or if you're mad at her, then maybe you have some jealousy issues or whatever. Again, you know, I'm just saying in general, you know, anybody who knows me or whatever, just looking at them like, ah, fight, fight, fight. I don't fight. I'm a lover, not a hater, you know. And when some bullshit goes down like it has in the last year, <sighs> There's just, there's nothing I can do about it. And, you know, they're ho hoping for like a good turnout. And, you know, I, I try to stay as positive as possible. But sometimes this shit makes me just want to go, you know, bang my head on the wall a few times until, you know, it feels better. Because there's not much else I can do. So I'm going to get this shit ready. This, and that's how we're going to end this podcast number one and then uh we'll see if we can get to a second podcast all right thanks for tuning in it's gonna get a lot better hopefully that explains a little bit of why i'm sitting here why this is here why this is here you know like well maybe it does maybe it doesn't I'm going to set up my pages so I can, you know, like read it and look at you at the same time. And hopefully everything will be all right. Uh, and even to those people who, who don't like me anymore or maybe said they did and never did, I have no ill will or ill feelings towards you. Uh, as I said, you know, it's all love. But if you've tried to hurt me or whatever, that's the only thing that really... I've been hurt so many times in my life. It's almost it's almost not even phasing me anymore. So I'm going to end this with, it's probably going to be another 10 minutes. 
and I'm going to basically read off this declaration and the shout outs thus far as of now, and then we can move on to other subjects. Thanks for watching. I've learned some things in the in this world and everything, and this last year has just been really, it's been some bullshit. So stick around. If you knew me from before and you're like, oh, he's starting his podcast up again, the Lotus Wolf podcast. This is the Lotus Wolf podcast one. All right. So I'm going to fiddle with my papers a little bit more and we'll get that ready for you. And then, you know, I'll read that out and hopefully move on and do some bigger, better things. Or maybe this will be the only one like this. Maybe, you know, like, uh, cause I'm doing a lot of songs and a lot of new songs and a lot of audio on my channel. Go check all that stuff out. There's a lot of good or not good stuff on there that you need or need not to see. Uh, but now you're seeing my smiling face. And hopefully we can get this. Maybe this will be a good thing. And then get this started and talk about other things than, than some bullshit. All right. And here we go. Peace out, y'all.